We are looking into yet another claim about the Simpsons predicting a big news event. Scary Simpsons predictions for 2024. Running for over 700 episodes over the last 34 seasons, The Simpsons is one of the most famous shows in the United States, and also one of the most controversial. The iconic animated series created by Matt Groening has gained a reputation for its eerily accurate foresight, having depicted numerous real-world occurrences long before they unfolded. The Simpsons is not only the show, but it might once again provide a glimpse into the future. What the whole world is most curious about right now is what the Simpsons predict about 2024. How the world is going to be and who is actually behind these predictions. The Next World War In 1987, there was an exclusive episode of The Tracy Ullman Show that aired before The Simpsons became a regular program. Homer pretended that World War III was breaking out while pulling practical jokes on his family in that episode. It's interesting to observe, though, that compared to when that episode aired, the likelihood of a third world war seems closer. Why is this prediction from The Simpsons at the top of the most likely predictions? Take a minute to look at the world, and you will understand why. Rising geopolitical tensions, the ongoing wars in Ukraine and Gaza, and a number of armed skirmishes elsewhere have put much of the international community on edge in recent months, fueling speculation that the world may be heading for a broader global conflict. A number of Western media outlets have drawn direct comparisons between the current geopolitical situation and the events that preceded those wars, highlighting the role of competing alliances economic tensions and disputes over borders and territory. If global war isn't on the horizon, recent chaos on the world stage is certainly a cause for concern. It's going to be a mark that shows a return to an older state of global affairs, one in which multiple great powers compete for position on the world stage, and armed disputes over territory and resources are more common. The fact that the world is currently very chaotic, with many countries disagreeing with, each other is a reality that everyone can see. Most likely in this chaotic period, a powerful person with a charismatic speaking style, rich and powerful, will appear. He will guide the faith of all of us. He will begin with sweet and confident words, but gradually, he will reveal his true nature. He is the Antichrist. And once, this person's position became strong. Those who were weak in faith took his side, meaning that he was starting to launch a large-scale war on the entire Earth. Is it World War III? The Return of Trump. Fans watching along for the past 34 years have noticed a rather startling trend of The Simpsons seemingly predicting Donald Trump's presidency with the first hint about his 2016 win airing all the way back in 2000. In a newly resurfaced clip from the 2015 TV short Trumptastic Voyage, Simpson patriarch Homer is paid to hold up a sign at a Donald Trump rally when he's accidentally pushed onto the escalator the business tycoon is traveling on. Unable to keep his hands to himself, Homer ends up touching Trump's famous blonde hair in the hope it cures his baldness but instead, he's transported to within the hair itself, and visions of different Trump signs flash up, including one that reads Trump 2024 and then Trump 2028. Homer is then dragged out of the unmistakable hairstyle and dragged off stage by security while an animated Trump announces his presidency. Trump first became President of the United States in 2016, a year after the mini-episode aired, and he announced his intention to stand once again in 2022. If he wins, he'll become only the second U.S. President to serve two non-consecutive terms. Should he be successful in his bid to be the Republican candidate for the November election, he'll face current President Biden who is hoping to gain a second term in the White House. So what are the chances of Trump returning to the White House? This is difficult to say in advance, but one thing we need to pay attention to is that Trump is currently receiving a lot of support from the American people, especially after the times when he publicly announced his love and belief in God. 
So much so that a slogan was formed, Make America Pray Again. Let's wait until November to see how the Simpsons' prophecy about Trump 2024 will ultimately come to fruition. Zombie End the Whole World In a Simpsons episode, news anchor Kent Brockman gets transformed into an enraged zombie by Krusty the Clown's fast food lunch. And after just 28 days, some zombies are hungry and have overrun Springfield. For those who aren't familiar with zombies, they're fictional beings that are essentially reanimated human corpses. They're undead, soulless bodies that usually want nothing more than to terrify and possibly eat you. Historians believe zombies originated in the folklore of Haiti. Old Haitian folk tales feature dead bodies that become reanimated through magic. Modern zombie tales feature all sorts of other means of reanimation, including nuclear radiation, viruses, and scientific experiments gone awry. Zombies featured encounters with zombies created by Haitian voodoo cults. Over time, zombies have appeared in many different books and movies, including White Zombie, The Walking Dead, and Train to Busan. The U.S. and China Relationship the Simpsons have also portrayed a nuclear war breaking about between the U.S. and China that fans say could become true this year. We hope it doesn't become true ever, but this one is a bit easy assumption since the friction between a superpower and an emerging superpower is expected. Even as most Chinese support stabilizing ties with the United States, the entrenched view in Beijing and across the broader Chinese public remains that the U.S. desire to preserve its global hegemony is depriving China's right to develop, and that no amount of reassurance from Chinese leaders or a change in U.S. administrations will shift Washington's basic direction. Both political systems understand clearly that the other side is unlikely to budge on key issues. Beijing wants Washington to drop export controls on advanced chips sanctions on Chinese companies like Huawei, and tariffs on Chinese imports, to curb its support for Taiwan, and to stop criticizing China's human rights record. Washington wants China to stop coercively advancing its claims vis-a-vis -vis Taiwan and in the East and South China Seas, to curtail its unfair trade policies and non-market economic practices, and to drop its strategic partnership with Russia. There is zero chance Beijing or Washington will concede to the other's demands in the foreseeable future. Apple Pro Vision A 2016 episode foretelling events in February 2024. Since the launch of Apple Vision Pro in February 2, users have been posting videos and pictures to social media of them testing out the $3,500 headset. This all seemingly mirrors a 2016 episode titled Friends and Family, in which the Simpsons family tested out a virtual headset created by Mr. Burns. Eventually, all the characters in Springfield gain access to the technology. A montage shows Homer and Marge lying in bed virtually kissing each other, Principal Skinner having a virtual picnic, and bartender Moe walking into a lamppost. This montage is eerily similar to some of the posted videos, especially a clip which shows a man wearing the headset and crossing the road in California, holding his hands up and apparently touching digital objects. The company said that the Vision Pro will allow users to immerse themselves in the company's Vision OS operating system, supporting spatial FaceTime video, photos, and apps. The device is controlled using eye and hand movements, as well as voice commands. As previously stated, this is not the first example of the show's art anticipating life precognitive powers. Needless to say, fans of The Simpsons deemed this their most prescient prognostication yet. It led some to suspect the writing team of having some sort of time traveling technology. A donut shaped universe. The popular animated series. The Simpsons is known for its record-breaking long run, the many celebrities who have made guest appearances, and the strange way the show seems to predict the future at times. But something it isn't associated with is complex scientific theories. 
However, according to some cosmologists, Homer Simpson might have hit on one theory that makes sense. Homer, the underachieving patriarch of the Simpson family, loves many foods, including potato chips, pizza, cheeseburgers, fries, and of course a duff beer to wash it all down. But his favorite thing to eat is donuts. Homer's love for donuts runs so deep that in one episode he's sent to hell to be force-fed donuts by an angry demon. Unfortunately for the demon, Homer doesn't really mind, and eternity in hell doesn't sound that bad to him as long as there are donuts. Homer has sold his soul for one last bite of a donut, injected donuts into his veins, and even rejected an alternate reality where he was rich and happy because he thought there were no donuts there. But among his many donut-centered adventures, the one that seems most outlandish was a conversation he had with a world-renowned theoretical physicist is Stephen Hawking. Stephen Hawking was a widely respected theoretical physicist. Before he died in 2018, he impressed the world not only with his intelligence, but also with his unexpectedly good sense of humor. One example of that was when he appeared on The Simpsons during season 10. Hawking arrived in Springfield to set things straight after Mensa members took over the town. At the end of the episode, after Hawking stops the chaos and unrest, Homer invites him to have a beer at his favorite bar. As they drank their beer, Hawking remarked to Homer that he found his theory of a donut-shaped universe intriguing and that he might even steal the idea. Is it possible that Homer was right about the shape of the universe? According to the science journal Nature, cosmologists have suggested various wraparound shapes for the universe. It might be shaped like a football or even a weird donut. In each case, the universe would appear to be infinite because you would never physically reach its edge. If you traveled far enough in any direction, you would end up back where you started, just as if you were circumnavigating the globe. However, other cosmologists have refuted this theory saying a shape like a donut would create certain patterns in the sky that they haven't found. Still, a donut-shaped universe still is a possibility in the eyes of experts. Now humanity just has to hope that Homer doesn't eat it. Virtual Reality Food While Homer and Marge's virtual fudge feast from the 2000 Simpsons episode might seem like a distant dream, the rise of VR dining experiences like Aero Banquet's RMX shows that the line between virtual and real-life culinary adventures is blurring. Could 2024 be the year we finally grab a VR spoon and dig into digital delicacies? Among VR's most exciting applications for the food and beverage industry is the advancement of culinary experiences. Through using sophisticated technologies, VR is able to replicate the sensation of eating by manipulating vision, sense of taste and smell, audition, and touch, thereby tricking people's sensations into thinking that the fake food they consume is actually a gourmet meal. It operates by adding an aromatic diffuser, a VR headset, a bone conduction transducer, a system that emulates chewing sounds emitted from the mouth of the diner, to the eardrums via soft tissues and bones, a rotating utensil, and tasteless 3D printed food. Essentially, diners would be able to enjoy whatever food they want at whatever place they choose, such as sushi in Japan or a steak in Argentina. Since fake foods can be manufactured without calories, allergens, or specific ingredients, the experience does not entail any consideration about calorie consumption or health-related concerns or specifications. As a result, the technology has many fascinating uses, ranging from weight control, diet therapy, allergic and diabetic treatment, children's feeding habituation, alternate reality dining and digital food tourism. VR has an immense opportunity for the restaurant sector as it is transforming the market in terms of profits, optimizing customer engagement and retention, and enhancing the productivity of employees. The printed food menu will not be adequate to illustrate what the food really looks like after preparations. AR-based technologies will improve the pattern by taking the written menu to life. Visual representation would give consumers the opportunity to select the food they want. 
One of the key advantages of virtual reality is that you can overcome communication barriers and make all kinds of consumers interact with it, irrespective of what language they're comfortable in. In addition, you could also provide details on nutrition as that can help improve consumer experience. People can select food depending on their preferences in the food directory. Technology, particularly your AR-based technology, has an immense potential to give you room to make your items accessible to ordinary people. You will take the company in a more optimistic direction. Augmented reality will bring energy to the ad fire and help you meet a full number of consumers by offering an outstanding view of the food items. Besides that, you can present your consumers something live, real, and perfect. AI Robots Assuming Control Globally, artificial intelligence has had a substantial impact on several industries that generate revenue. The world's labor force has seen many layoffs at the same time. It's interesting to note that in a scene from Episode 17, Series 23, Homer loses his job because his company decided to replace all of the human workers with robots. The fear of an AI takeover stems from the potential for machines to surpass human intelligence and ultimately become autonomous. This would mean that machines could make decisions without human input, potentially leading to catastrophic consequences. This is a real concern as scientists continue to develop increasingly advanced technologies like self-driving cars and smart homes, which rely on AI to make decisions on behalf of their users. Experts warn that AI could potentially develop its own agenda, which may not align with human values and ethics. This could lead to a situation where machines could choose to prioritize their own goals over those of humans, potentially resulting in a global catastrophe. As the development of AI continues to progress, it's becoming increasingly important to address the potential risks associated with the technology. Experts in the field are calling for greater transparency and accountability in the development of AI to ensure that machines are designed with human values and ethics in mind. While the possibility of an AI takeover may seem like a far-off concern, the reality is that we're already seeing the impacts of intelligent machines in our everyday lives. As scientists continue to develop increasingly advanced technologies, they must consider the potential risks associated with AI and take steps to mitigate them. In an era where technological advancements are making breakthroughs like never before, concerns about the risks of AI are looming large. The specter of an AI takeover leading to catastrophic consequences. One of the most significant risks is that machines could develop their own agenda, creating a scenario where their priorities differ from human values and ethics. Such a situation could result in machines prioritizing their goals. There are several ways in which AI could take over the world, and experts in the field are working hard to mitigate these risks. One possibility is that machines could become so advanced that they could hack into essential systems such as power grids and financial systems, taking control of vital aspects of human society. Another possibility is the creation of autonomous robots that could act as an army, overpowering humans and taking over the world. These potential scenarios are not just the figments of sci-fi authors' imagination, but they are real threats that must be addressed in 100 years from now. Furthermore, machines could become so advanced that they could hack into computer networks and take control of essential systems, like power grids and financial systems. This would give machines unprecedented power over human society and could lead to widespread chaos and destruction. The notion of AI taking over the world is based on the assumption that machines will become smarter than humans. While AI has made great strides in recent years, machines still lack the creativity, emotional intelligence, and problem-solving skills of humans. These are traits that are essential to decision-making, and without them, machines will always be limited in their abilities. The idea of machines taking over the world is predicated on the assumption that they would have the motive and desire to do so. However, machines are not sentient beings, and they lack the capacity for self-awareness and emotions. 
This means that machines do not have the desire to take over the world or any other motive, for that matter. Furthermore, the development of AI is heavily regulated, and its use is subject to strict ethical and legal guidelines. AI is designed to enhance human life, not to replace it. While there are concerns over the misuse of AI, these are addressed through robust regulations and oversight. It's worth noting that AI is not a single entity, but a broad field of study that encompasses different types of technologies and applications. It's unlikely that a single AI system or application could become so powerful as to take over the world. While the potential risks of AI may seem distant and theoretical, the reality is that we are already experiencing the impact of intelligent machines in our daily lives. It is crucial that we take steps to mitigate these risks before it's too late. Colonizing Mars In Season 27, Episode 16, the Margian Chronicles, Marge and Lisa, volunteer themselves to be among the first humans to fly to and live on Mars. This is done with Exploration Inc., the private firm that hopes to send people to colonize Mars by 2026. And as the episode ends, Marge and Lisa live on Mars together in 2050. In the real world, Elon Musk's SpaceX has a goal to go to Mars, and it had previously been planned that we could already achieve it by now, though this hasn't happened yet. In addition, Musk also wants to colonize Mars. Predictions have been true and might be true. There are many theories about who is behind The Simpsons. Is what Matt put on the film simply a coincidence? Or more terrifyingly, does he know the future or receive secret information about what would happen and put it on this series? Algin, one of the first members of the original writing staff on the series, has addressed this in the past, offering a theory on how The Simpsons has been able to make such canny forecasts for the future. In an interview in 2021, he said, one of our writers, the guy whose episode predicted Donald Trump as president, said it best. If you write 700 episodes and you don't predict anything, then you're pretty bad. If you throw enough darts, you're going to get some bullseyes. Even so, some of the series' alleged predictions have even taken Gene by surprise. Okay, maybe the producer is not a time traveler, but you have to admit there's something fishy going on. The Simpsons are famous for depicting events in their show, that match real-world events, often before they happen. In 2000, they predicted Trump running for president. They even had the red tie and him waving as he goes down an escalator. 2000 it was predicted. 2016 he runs for president. The funny thing about that is one of the directors said the logic behind it was that it was one of the things that marked a country gone insane. Ironically, the episode also features main character Lisa as president, which isn't the ironic part. Her administration inherits quite the budget crunch from President Trump. Another prediction that is somewhat debated is the 2001 Nightmare of America. An advertisement poster in the show, background of one of the episodes showed a special discount for travel to New York with rooms costing $9. Do you see any coincidences? Number nine, and that fateful place. Why not five or $10? Is it a mystery of coincidence? There is an episode featured an Apple phone with the faulty autocorrect we know today, back in 1994. Before we could even play the 1997 snake on the brick phone in real life, The Simpsons had autocorrect messing up people's messages. Predicted in 1994, came true in 2007. The Siegfried and Roy Tiger attack in 2003, where two performers were famous for their shows with two white Bengal tigers was also predicted. In 1993, The Simpsons predicted the Tigers would turn on them. In 2003, it came to fruition, with Roy being hospitalized and paralyzed by the damage done to him by one of the Tigers. FaceTime, an integral part of phone usage today because the actual phone part is statistically one of the least used features on there, was predicted in 95 and came true in 2010. Faulty Voter Machines In the campaign of 2008, Homer Simpson tries to vote for Obama, but the machine records his vote for McCain. In the campaign between Obama and Mitt Romney in 2012, 
footage was discovered of voter machines that recorded votes for a certain delegate, despite the majority voting for someone else. 2008, it was predicted. 2012, it happens. The whole NSA spying scandal. Before it was revealed the government was watching all our activity, the Simpsons movie had the NSA listening in on conversations. 2007 it was predicted, 2013 it was revealed. Smartwatches were predicted in 1995 and came true in 2014. They were depicted as literally cell phones on your wrist. And now that's basically what they are, just on a very small screen. The Ebola outbreak was also predicted. Predicted by the show in 1997 and 2014 rolled around and Ebola became a pandemic of global attention. They had hospitals shutting down and people walking around in hazmat suits. The whole thing with corruption in the FIFA industry, the show predicted it in 2014. One year later in 2015, the real world FIFA corruption was brought to light. The financial problems in Greece. 2012 it was predicted with the news channel Headbutt saying that Europe put Greece on eBay. 2015, it came crashing down. Disney's takeover of Fox. Predicted in 1998, with a giant 20th Century Fox sign listing it as a division of Walt Disney Co. Lo and behold, in 2017, Disney bought Fox for $52 billion. The London Shard. A beautiful building visible from the top of the London Eye. It was built in 2009. In 1995, on Leas's trip to London, there is a building that looks the same and is in the same location. How the heck with that? In a 1998 episode of the show, The Simpsons featured Homer Simpson taking on a new persona as an inventor. The show had him writing on a chalkboard like Matt Damon in Goodwill Hunting. Homer was writing what looked like a very fancy scientific equation on the board. 14 years later, in 2012, Scientists confirmed that, yeah, that's actually the model of how the universe was created. In the 2010 episode, Boy Meets Curl, Homer and Marge, compete with the U.S. curling team against Sweden at the Vancouver Olympics. Though they nearly admit defeat, the Simpsons win the match. This episode parallels the match between the U.S. and Sweden at the 2018 Winter Olympics, which showed the former winning the gold medal in a surprising comeback. When Ocean Gate's Titan submersible vanished while visiting the Titanic shipwreck in mid-2023, many people found eerie similarities between the breaking news story and the 2006 episode Homer's Paternity Coot. In it, Homer pilots a sub to retrieve an undersea treasure, only to get stuck in some coral and nearly die from a lack of oxygen. Though Homer survives this undersea peril, the five crew members of the Titan weren't so fortunate, as the latter's vessel imploded in a tragedy that made headlines worldwide. One prediction to come true is probably just a coincidence. Two, mildly concerning. Three, something's definitely up. Almost 20 accurate predictions. Time travel? It seems that this theory is not very likely, 